The rugby league community is mourning the untimely death of NRL cult hero Carl Webb, who passed away at the age of 42 after battling motor neuron disease. Webb's legacy extends beyond the playing field, leaving an indelible mark on the sport and the hearts of fans. Carl Webb's remarkable career Webb's rugby league journey was marked by grit, determination, and a fierce competitive spirit. Beginning his career with the Brisbane Broncos, he quickly gained a reputation as a formidable forward, earning him a spot in the Queensland State of Origin team. His physical prowess and never-say-die attitude endeared him to fans across the nation. The impact of motor neuron disease Tragically, Carl Webb's life took an unexpected turn when he was diagnosed with motor neuron disease. This debilitating condition gradually robbed him of his physical abilities, but Webb faced the challenge with courage and resilience. Despite the adversity, he continued to inspire others with his positive attitude and determination to raise awareness about the disease. Farewell messages and tributes As news of Carl Webb's passing spread, tributes poured in from fellow players, coaches, and fans alike. The rugby league community came together to celebrate his contributions to the sport and express condolences to his family. Webb's legacy lives on through the memories he created on and off the field. The fight against motor neuron disease Webb's battle with motor neuron disease highlights the urgent need for continued research and support for those affected by this devastating condition. Organizations dedicated to finding a cure and supporting individuals and families impacted by the disease play a crucial role in raising awareness and funds. Reflecting on a life well lived in remembering Carl Webb, it is essential to focus not only on the challenges he faced but also on the moments of triumph and the impact he had on the rugby league community. His legacy serves as a reminder of the strength of the human spirit and the power of sport to unite people in times of sorrow.